This video is for Miss, Mrs. J. Brown. There's my jet wash look dowels. There's my buckets. There's my bleacher water. There's my jet wash. There's my monkeys look outside. Nice clean every. And it hasn't even been cleaned today. There's the two monkeys looking. Well, I'll show you inside, darling. Bag of sawdust on the floor. Right. Just cleaned them out, look. Nice clean walls. Let me take the bars off for you. And you can see, can't you? Hang on. Look at that fresh sawdust underneath there. Fresh straw. All the patches look a little bit brown. Do you know why? Because I've bleached them all and I've just washed them all. There's the monkeys, look outside. Wanted to come back in. Washed all the nest box down. And all the walls are pure white, look. And these monkeys have lived in this enclosure now for five years it looks like it's just been built but this is what it's like when mama's ex you've got to keep them clean now i'm going to go straight across in a minute and all these trays up here look there's one that's got to be taken down they all got sawdust inside there's a little drawer here look take the drawer out look and when the pee or poo it goes in the little drawer you tip it in the bin it's not hard you tip it in the bin and you wipe it with bleach and then you put fresh sawdust in and your monkeys are happy. Then I'll go and do that one, that one. This area I've just cleaned out, look. Lovely white walls. Look at Have you noticed there's not one blob of poo, I'll say poo, on the perches. Because every day they're bleached out. There's the pipe that they play on, there's the tyres, there's the floor, look. How spotless the floor is. But this lady was talking to my friend and she said, your, your friend doesn't know what he's on about with his monkeys. But my monkeys are happy, love. They really are happy. Mrs. J. Brown of Norfolk. So, until you start, um, oh, this one I'm being cleaned out today. Let's have a look how bad it is inside. Oh, I can see three blobs of poa. I can't tolerate that, I'll have to take it out. But, you know, a quick wipe every day, you know, keep on top of it, and then you're, uh, you know, look at, look at it, keep on top of it, an hour a day, it's pointless leaving it for a month, and having a full day's graft at it, isn't it? You might as well do it every single day, but obviously I don't know nothing, do you know what I mean? I don't know anything, you know, so, let me just open this door, look. There you go, look. I'll open this door. There's a little lever down here. You won't see it because it's too dark. But you open the door, look. There's a door. Come on, then. Come on. Come on, then. Yeah. Come on, baby. Come on, then. Come on, then. Come on. You're coming in. You're coming in. Come on, then. That's how we get them in, look. Come on. I suppose that's when they're happy, isn't it? They want to come in that play. Because they'll just being, they love, these monkeys love to be cleaned out. They know the routine. I'll go outside for half an hour. Let Dad clean us out. And then we'll all come back in and chill out. And mess it up again. And he can do it again tomorrow for us, can he? Yes. He can, there's little baby, look. Oh, what am I not bringing you, Dad? We hope you can hear the fireworks outside. There's mum. Oh, that's elder brother, elder sister. There's dad up there, look. All happy. Happy as sun boys. There's a baby, look. They're not bothered. But this is what it's like when you clean them out every day, you know. They get tame. Because uh, you're communicating with them, aren't you? You know, you're associating with them. But this is a little part of my cleaning regime. Every, every Sunday, I call it bombing them out. Everything comes out so the straw the lot. And then on a night, give them a quick wipe out. There's one through the window, look. Look how clean that window is. Unbelievable. What a bit of uh, bleach does. Do you like the camera? Do you want to hit the camera? Yeah, a little of them. I think Kevin wanted one of these, but obviously because they haven't had a very good upbringing, I don't think he wants one. So, I don't know. 
Anybody who's been to this place knows the score. They know how to look after them. So if Mrs. Uh, J. Brown or whatever her name is wants to come down and inspect the place, don't tell me you're coming. Come on and ask because I like this every day. I don't have to clean up because somebody's coming. I spend my full Sunday, my day off work, doing these. You don't have no social life when you've got monkeys like. What do you do if you keep them like some people do? Not man though. Right, I'm going anyway. I've got a crack on. Ta-ra.